Thank you for joining me on this month's market review and we've just finished January 2020 so it's the first review of the year. We're already in February, time is already flying by. So anyone that's been watching my videos over the past few weeks have probably noticed that I've been talking about a surge, called it a few different names, the Brexit bounce, the Boris bounce, which has basically meant since the election there's been what we felt as in a stage and a massive confidence and surge onto the market. But how has that transferred into the figures? Have we seen an incredible rise in everything? You know, sales, listings, everything like that compared to last year. So let's have a quick look. So sales in 2020 January compared to 2019 were 47% down. Listings were 50% down, which sort of contradicts everything I've been saying until you look at the amount of viewings that my company has had this month. We've done over 312 viewings this month. That's a record. Now, it might mean nothing to you that, but basically we average about 150 viewings a month. So we've literally doubled the amount of viewings and that's where we're getting the confidence and the, the surge and the buoyancy. So sales are down, listings down, but viewings are up. We have made quite a number of decent sales over the past few weeks as well. Um, now, before we talk about reduced properties, a lot of you are interested in the average prices in the area, so I'll put them on screen here now, so you can have a quick read through while I just talk about our uh, reduced properties. Uh, so last year there were 14 reduced properties in January and this year just 13. So again, pretty much the same, similar, not much to write home about, uh, pretty different. Again, I always like to see the market around about single figures, about 10, have said that numerous times before, so this is just over it, so not too bad. Uh, here are a few properties that have been successful on the last few weeks as well uh, for those of you that are interested. Uh, now like I says viewings are way up over a, re a record month so if you are interested in putting your house on the market as I've said sales and listings down nearly 50% on both uh, which means inevitably there's going to be a supply and demand issue at some point in the next few weeks when those sales start to catch up but listings aren't replacing them which means that positive, uh, prices could go up a little bit, which is uh, one to keep an ear out for. So thank you for watching uh, January Market Wrap. I hope you've enjoyed it. If there's any questions at all, any property questions, or if I can help at all with anyone, please message me on Facebook anytime or give us a call. It's 0161 696 5050. And I'll see you next month.